need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. If you click the Power View tab within the ribbon, you will see the button groups that you can use to format the appearance of the Power View sheet itself. At the far left end of this tab is the Clipboard Button Group, which contains buttons that allow you to cut, copy, and paste data visualizations within the Power View. This is followed by the Undo and Redo Button Group that allows you to undo and redo actions that are taken within a Power View sheet. You can use the buttons within the Themes button group to apply and customize a theme for your PowerView sheet. This includes changing the font, the text size, and background applied to the elements within a PowerView sheet. If you want to add a custom image to the background of the PowerView sheet, you can click the Set Image drop-down button within the Background Image button group and then choose the Set Image command from the drop-down menu to open a dialog box that allows you to select an image to use from the files on your computer. You can click this same button and then choose the Remove Image command to remove a background image that you have applied if needed. If you choose to apply a background image, you can then use the Image Transparency and image position buttons to set the placement and transparency of inserted background images. You can also use the refresh and relationships button within the data button group to refresh the underlying data within the data source and create relationships within the data source if needed. You can click the buttons within the view button group to toggle the display of the corresponding elements within the power view sheet on and off. You can click the buttons that appear within the insert button group to select a type of object to insert, a power view sheet, a text box, or a picture. You can select an object within the power view sheet and then click the Arrange button in the Arrange button group to change the placement of the objects within a stack of objects if needed. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing.